So this is our cargo loader. Right now, this deck is, um, has the ability to load four 6.3L pallets on it and any other pallet you want. The forks on the front are removable and they stow underneath the tractor, but those forks can lift 4,000 pounds. This deck right here can go from, let's call it 34 or so inches all the way up to 60 inches. Um, you can tip this forward. We have a winch, it's not on here, but a winch connects back here with the pulley. And that winch and pulley allow you to self-load a pallet on here. When the pallet is on this piece of equipment, the pallet rests on these stanchions. When you're ready to load the pallet into an aircraft or push a pallet off here, you lift our scissor deck, which I'll demonstrate, and then the pallet sits on these rollers. These rollers allow you to easily push up to a 10,000 pound pallet off these rollers into an aircraft. This whole equipment is run by remote control, as you can see here, which gives you the ability to not only actuate the deck, actuate the forks, drive the equipment, but this engine, you can actuate it up and down at your own desire. So the thing about this engine actuating up and down is if you wanted to drive this into an aircraft, you can track the engine up so you can go up a steep incline. What is the angle we can do? So the requested angle is 18.5, but this one's ready for 30 degrees. So we can, we can go up a 30 inch incline without this dragging. Also good thing about that is all the engine is tacked back here. So if we wanted to, we can raise this engine up. You can drive this equipment virtually underwater and keep the engine up out of the water so this can operate in water. This attachment right here comes off, and as you've seen in the other, you can actually add other attachments on, other forklift attachments. Snow blades, skid steer attachments, um, mowers, which we have one over there in the back corner of the shop. So there's a lot of attachments that this piece of equipment has. 